Good morning, Britain. The race to stop the mutant virus. Tens of thousands are to be tested in a desperate bid to stop the South African strain. But did the government ignore advice to close the borders to prevent the spread? Prayers for Captain Sir Tom Moore. This morning his family are with him in hospital as he continues to battle coronavirus. Social distancing scrapped, life returns to normal on the Isle of Man as cases almost disappear. A glimpse into the future for the rest of us, we're there live this morning. And a moment of reflection. This morning we're joined by the Archbishop of Canterbury as he calls on Boris Johnson to confess his regret over his handling of the pandemic. He's with us after seven. Tuesday, 2nd of February, 2021. Live from Television Centre in London, this is Good Morning Britain with Piers Morgan and Susanna Reid. Good morning, Britain. Just gone half past six. Just, just realise something. You always start the show, don't you? No, I start with yeah. the headlines. But, but you're always you the first person. You start the show. Yeah, but when people tune in... You start the show, you, no, no, Piers you Morgan, always, You're always the first person to speak, aren't you? Yes. Oh, it's always been like that in five and a half years, Yeah. Right? I just think in light of the, of the woke movement yeah. about... Do you feel you, you don't can't... speak enough? Well, no, you can't, you know, in a pack of Do cards... Do you think we don't hear enough you know, in a pack of cards, from mate, you your have, mouth? You can't have a king above a queen, right? And obviously in chess, you know, you, yeah. the king is more powerful. I, I just think it's yeah. time that I said... Maybe we'll turn A little bit days. more. Well, I think alternate days. I, you go first one day. And then we have it completely equal. OK, so uh, if we're going to... Otherwise, it's sexist. OK, if we're going to have it completely equal, mm. can we time how much time Piers mm. Morgan takes up in Absolutely. the entire show? Absolutely. With you know what? speaking... You know what would horrify you? Is if you counted how long our questions are... Yeah. You think it's me yeah. that and, rabbits and you on think aggression. It's me. Oh, my God. I, oh, I can, my God. I can make a cup of tea when you're oh, asking questions, honestly. Really? Yeah. Honestly. Oh, and your questions are so succinct. Questions as opposed to... Uh, Theses. Well, you know, I, when I talk about, you know, right team issues. You have a mission. Yeah. Who asks the longest questions honestly, on Good Morning? I can honestly, go and make a cup of tea when you start. Yeah. Uh, but my point really is the at the start of the show, it's always you. You're always the first voice people hear. And I'm just thinking that you're so you're so active in the woke world, and you're so keen to see playing cards. You know, abandoned because yep. they put the king above the queen, and yep. in chess, Outrageous. the last piece is the king, which is obviously sexist. I just think it would be right and fair if every other day now I'm the first voice of the public here, because uh, then it's equal, and um, we all want gender equality, don't we? Yeah, mm. definitely. <laughs> I just thought that this morning. But why do you want to go first? It's really, right. it's become insufferable. As you I might say to a representative of mm. uh, PETA, the mm. People for the Ethical Treatment of Animals, you know there are more important things going yeah. on right now. You know what, now, let's change their name to Morgan? Petty. Because obviously I'm just joking. I don't give a stuff who starts the show. It makes no difference to me, because very quickly I do all the talking anyway. <laughs>